The St. Bernard and Poodle mix is known as a St. Berdoodle. These giant dogs have a charming and cheerful personality. They are affectionate, loving, and highly intelligent. They can be non-shedding and even approach hypoallergenic. This breed really combines some of the most excellent features of the noble and cheeky St. Bernard and the low-shedding and wickedly smart poodle. Like all poodle mix crossbreeds, the St. Berdoodle is not considered to be a purebred. As such, it does not have recognition from the AKC, but this is not unique. AKC doesn't recognize even the insanely popular Labradoodle. Before I move on with the video, I want to ask you a simple question. Do you want to train your dog for any basic commands like sit and stay? Do you want to stop any of the behavioral problems of your dog like pooping inside the house, biting, jumping, or barking? If your answer is yes, please grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. The secret training technique ebook is available for free only for a limited time. So go and grab it before it's too late. Link to the free ebook and training videos is in the description below. What does the St. Bernard Poodle Mix look like? How amazingly handsome is Toast the St. Berdoodle? His parents were a St. Bernard and a standard poodle. Picture a gentle giant teddy bear with dark eyes and an enormous head. The coat can hide a surprisingly slender poodle-like muzzle. The musculature tends to be well-built and sturdy. Rippling muscle is common, but the poodle parent breed's lean frame can show through with tall legs and high-set hindquarters. They come in black and multicolored options. Mostly the coats are white with either tan, brown, or black. The variation comes from both the poodle and St. Bernard side. Multicolor just means there is brown or tan incorporated into the coat. How big do St. Berdoodles get? Do not underestimate the possible giant size of a St. Berdoodle. They regularly grow in weight to 100 to 200 pounds. St. Berdoodles also frequently stand up to 30 inches at the shoulder. These are often large dogs. As a result, expect a high intake of food. Expect 4 to 8 cups of kibble per day, depending on the final weight of the St. Berdoodle. Even as a puppy, they can consume a relatively extraordinary volume of food. The Street Berdoodle is a beautiful poodle mix cross breed. What is the St. Berdoodle lifespan? The lifespan of a St. Berdoodle is halfway between that of its parent breeds. Expect 8 to 12 years. The smaller the St. Bernard Poodle mix, the longer the lifespan. Miniature St. Berdoodles would expect a trend toward a longer lifespan. An F1B St. Berdoodle would experience a longer average lifespan than an F1, 50% St. Bernard and 50% Poodle. This is because the smaller breed lives longer. Are St. Berdoodles good with kids? St. Berdoodles are known to be child-friendly. Like any more giant breed, be mindful of the size discrepancy, especially when they are puppies. A large excited dog can scare or accidentally hurt a younger child. You should never leave a small child unattended with a dog or puppy even if they are trusted. How much exercise do St. Berdoodles need? St. Berdoodles are gentle giants, but they do have daily exercise needs. Most require at least 20 minutes of light moderate exercise per day. They can also get this from 30 to 45 minutes of self-directed play. Some St. Berdoodles will have a much higher requirement. In general, though, be cautious with the extra-large breeds as their greater mass requires a lot more effort to do physical activity. Particularly in the warmer months, ensure lots of breaks for your St. Berdoodle. St. Berdoodles do not make good running partners. As a general rule, the body weight and wear and tear on joints make giant breeds or hybrids unsuitable for endurance exercise. So running a half marathon with your St. Berdoodle is unlikely. The same is true for Bernadoodles, who love to run but are not suitable for long-term training. Do St. Berdoodles shed? A St. Bernard Poodle cross can inherit traits from both parent breeds. For many, the ideal situation is that the non-shedding and allergy-friendly coat of the Poodle is inherited. This can mean a more perfect outcome for those with asthma or who just don't like cleaning up hair. At the end of the day, though, crossbreeding is a genetic lottery and some St. Berdoodles will shed and some will not. Separation Anxiety in St. Berdoodles 
Like many poodle mixes, we need to be mindful of the strong attachment that forms between Saint Berdoodle and your family. Breeds like the Bernie Doodle and Labradoodle are known for experiencing separation anxiety. The same is true for the giant Saint Berdoodle. This is indeed a problem as there are many instances where a dog needs to be able to cope with being alone. The cause, however, is actually from a beautiful place. The reason Saint Berdoodles can develop separation anxiety is due to their caring and loving nature. Both parent breeds have a strong desire to integrate into your family pack. They want to be part of the family. Separation anxiety for Saint Berdoodles can vary from a mild case of whining right through to severe anxiety and destructive behaviors. Luckily there are guidelines for animal behavior experts to help manage and minimize the impact of separation anxiety. Health issues for Saint Berdoodles Poodle mixed breeds can inherit health problems from either parent breed. In general, though, both the Poodle and Saint Bernard are relatively healthy dogs. Be mindful of skin conditions, both breeds, and stick with a simple natural diet to avoid food allergies. Larger dog breeds can have problems with knees and limbs so consult a veterinarian early and consistently to monitor for issues. In general, you would be hopeful for a healthy, happy dog without too many complications. Health is a game of chance, though, so regular checks are vital. St. Bernard Poodle Mix Conclusions A St. Berdoodle is an amazingly friendly and cheerful breed. It is stunningly pretty poodle mix with the possibility of a non-shedding coat. While chatting with St. Berdoodle owners, my love for this type of dog has deepened. When we get a larger dog, the cross will definitely make the list of possibilities. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the secret training technique guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the channel Little Paws Training if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.